Well, on to a legal case you're going to love. Parents get blamed for about everything these days, but a homeless man in New York is taking family strife to a whole new level. 32-year-old aspiring rapper Bernard Bay slamming his parents with a $200,000 lawsuit because, get this, they didn't give him enough love. Joining me now, criminal defense attorney Regina Tombanakis Tom and Fox News legal analyst Lise Wheel. All right. The story, Lise, to me is crazy. Uh, does this young man have a case? Absolutely not. There is no case here. I mean, once you're at the AIDS of emancipation, you're out of the house. The 18, have, done. 18, you're done. You're cooked. You're over. That's it. To come back now at age 32, and here's what he's asking, Jerry. I want you parents to mortgage your house to the tune of $200,000. So what? So I can buy a couple of franchises, Domino's Pizza. I mean, are they all going to be spending the night at the floor there? Regina, you disagree with this. Why? Well, look. This sounds crazy, and he probably is crazy. He's probably mentally ill. He is trying to get his family's attention. He said he would drop the suit if they would invite him to dinner. I oh. mean, the parents aren't responsible to provide for him at 32, but clearly he suffered abuse, he's gone through a lot, and he's trying to get his parents' attention. Maybe this is the only way he can do it. Wait, to go Will out he and prevail hire... in court? Wait, uh, no, but he can a... file any suit he'd like. Well, Lisa, okay, so, a lawyer? so should this be in the criminal court system? No, it shouldn't, and I'm embarrassed that, that a lawyer actually took this because, you know, he got in the, into the system. Come on, I think we earlier Hey, listen, do we remember the Donald's no coffee incident? Respect. Well, I wouldn't have taken that case. So <laughs> and I'm embarrassed that a listen, lawyer did. Listen, anything can happen. McDonald's coffee. Would anybody have ever thought right. a million dollars, million dollars would have come out of that? So let's be not, not be cutting everything off that way. Here, his parents live in the projects. There's no money. No one's going to get anything, even if he did sue. So it's, it's, it's you know, it's but literally a cry for attention. He's 32. A mentally Ill child 32 been, years old. That's he's it. mentally ill. They should have gotten him help along time ago. What are they waiting on? Well, okay, here's now my he's question. a burden on society. <laughs> but, but here's my question. Not, so who's paying for all of this? Where is the money coming from for this? He's in a court of law. He's got an attorney, right. Lise. The lawyer must have he's taken it on He's doing it himself or legal aid. I doubt legal aid would, but uh, he's typed it up all on himself. On a contingency basis. And then the, what the lawyer, here's what I'm thinking is, they got this filed. And he's, they're just hoping, they're not going to get the 200, but they're hoping for 20,000, something like that. That they'll, the parent, you know, they'll settle this with the parents. This guy would go away for 500 up. bucks. I, I would think so. No maybe money. just a they dinner. Mom and dad assistance. just cook him a dinner. Although, can you imagine being in that household for dinner? And the mother says she's, uh, <laughs> Regina says she's frightened of her son. Did you read that? Well, yeah, again, another, you know, big ring, big sign. Maybe you should have gotten him help as a child. He's mentally ill. Oh, help come the on, guy you're before he comes to this. Years old. At what you point? have a responsive Yeah, but what about when he was 12? What about when he was 5? These all these things don't just happen when you're 32. Oh, I don't know. You, you, but I mean, should he take responsibility yeah. for you don't himself or you slip your son here, here's, a the, here's the problem with that rationale. The slippery slope argument, which is that any time then if this what? were to go forward, any time that a parent missed a school, will play or didn't wipe a nose properly or forgot homework or didn't pack a proper lunch, you're going to get sued when your child is 32? That's where we're going this with country, this. You can sue anybody for anything. I'm not saying you're going to prevail. Don't get me wrong. But you can. But what this, in this particular topic, it's clear that this, this man is mentally ill. His parents should have taken care of this a long time ago when he was a child, and maybe I'm, now he wouldn't be homeless I living think off the state. There's public dollars I mean, being wasted have a responsibility. on this right now. Absolutely. Least. Last word. Public dollars being wasted. The judge, here's what the judge should do throw this out. All right. Wow. I think we settled this one. Okay. I think this is done. <laughs> You're 32. You're on your own, buddy. Yep. Regina and Lace, thanks for coming on tonight. Great conversation. Really appreciate no the hearing both sides of that. And when we come back, thanks. how to make your portfolio.